Right then, folks, here we go, Ford Thames. It's a special old truck, this, for uh, numerous reasons, really, but uh, I was I was asked earlier the, in the year uh, if, um, if I would drive the truck with its owner, Graham, on the back to the creme. Now, uh, he said when he bought the truck, he said on film, some of you will have seen it on the show, uh, that... Um, when the day came, he would. This was to be his final journey on the old truck, and I was asked to drive it, which I did. Uh, so um, I had a terribly difficult day, really. Uh, but um, anyway, I was honoured to do it, uh, and I would, I would do it again, no problem at all. Uh, so um, the truck itself, get on with the truck, um, is. Superb, really. It's in fantastic order. Look, everywhere you look, it's so so solid, unmolested. It is a very special um, old truck. Obviously, as we all know, most trucks bought, worked, abused, thrown away. This one somehow has survived. Now we're not saying it's absolutely pristine everywhere, bits and pieces, but it's as solid as a rock. It's as solid a one as you're going to find, and it's as unmolested as you're going to find. You know, a bit of paint polished through, bits and pieces, little tiny li little bits of rust just starting, uh, but so minimal. You wouldn't rush to paint it and lose all that originality. You just would not. Um, so in recent times, it's had a set of tyres. The body was rubbed down and varnished. Look, it looks wonderful, looks superb. Uh, things like mud guards were painted, I think, if memory serves, some brake work. So in a nutshell, you could jump in the truck and drive away. Uh, I did, I don't know what we did, maybe 20 mile or something, maybe not quite as much as that, up and around Penrith uh, with, um, obviously, I brought Graham on the back. So, um, so I have a, a little bit of an attachment with it. Uh, I don't know his brother Dave does. And uh, yeah, as with his Zodiac, which I did half an hour ago, did a video on his Zodiac. We would all much rather they were still in Penrith and Gray was still about. Miss him. But the truck, superb, absolutely smashing old truck. It really, really is. Everywhere you look, she's lovely. Covers off the battery, ready to take a battery lead off of there, look. Um, but um, as I say, she is lovely. Hottest day of the year his funeral was. It certainly felt like it in there. Um, didn't get hot, no, um, no nastiness. Uh, it gave us a little bit of a scare. We, were, we, were, we had to pull over on the way yeah, just round the corner from the crematorium, let the traffic pass. We developed a bit of a convoy. Um, I think there was 40 odd classics in tow. Not in tow, but you know, in the, in the, in the procession. Uh, and, um, and we stopped and we turned it off while, it, um, while everyone sorted themselves out. <laughs> and it didn't want to start a bit of fuel evaporation. And we we're all thinking, Hah. but um, anyway, it did start and, uh, and concluded the last quarter of a mile. No problem at all. So there you go, pop down. There's a bit of the history, a bit of the background, all the rest of it. Proper, proper little truck. And I hope and pray the next guy is going to nurture it just like Graham did. Um, Come down and have a look. And look after it. Probably. And look after it. Yeah. Exactly right. Don't be thinking you're going to put it to work. We're not having it, are we? Yeah. No. <laughs> We've got to be looked after, cherished. Pop down, have a look, guys. Thank you.